Hey, y'all. Okay, sorry I got caught up reading. How are y'all? Let's see, I'm gonna put this over here so I can kind of be looking at the camera for that. Okay, so this wasn't scheduled or anything. Um, I just decided time's ticking. We're getting ready for Super Bowl. And um, I better jump on and do a live before I have to get Colton. So as you come in, say, hey, let me know that you're here so I know I'm not alone. And if I, if I am, it's okay. Since it is Super Bowl Sunday, we're just going to do something really quick um, for... St. Patrick's Day. Just a little quick um, door hanger. And then, hey Tammy, how are you? Something fun. So these are, I love these little things right here. And I'm gonna figure out how to do it this way. Hello, hello, cold and snowy in Connecticut. Yeah, it's kind of cold here. Not as bad as it's been though. We've had some yucky cold too. Hey, Nancy. Okay, so I'm gonna pull this one, this tag out because I don't need that. Um, but I'm gonna leave this one in because that's gonna be my top. Hey, Monica, how are you? All right, I better cut this glue down. I could see it smoking over here. Cut the alarms off. People are gonna be thinking I'm cooking. Not cooking. Hey, Diana from Texas, how are you? So y'all, I've got the Easy Mo Maker. Hey, Eva. I know this was this was just a quick. Let's throw together a live real quick and um, make something fun and quick and happy and cheerful because we all need some happy and cheerful stuff. All right, so this bow is going to be basically like the Terry bow. Um, I'm going to make two bows. I don't know if I want them both to be the same. I'm only gonna use this as my two, I'm gonna probably just use two ribbons. Okay. Hey y'all, make sure you, if you're with us, just, if you don't mind showing some love, I would greatly appreciate it. I got something sticky on my scissors. I knew I was supposed to do something before I went live. Hey, Rachel. I'm so glad you caught me. All right, so I'm gonna, um, now my ribbons did not come from Dollar Tree because I have a ton of ribbon. I do have some ribbon from Dollar Tree, but not for St. Patrick's Day, so. Anyway, so I'm gonna use what I've got. That's what I suggest, just use what you got, y'all. This is that green that they that Sam's had at Christmas. Isn't it pretty? Let's show y'all. Let's get a little closer. Oh, I like the new Sam's spring ribbon too. But that's pretty. Somebody hit my Sam's up for I got paid, so which was probably a good thing. I got too much ribbon. But I got what I wanted anyway. All right, so all I'm doing is just making single loops and just going a little bit smaller. Um, Y'all, I don't, when I do my stuff, yeah, Tammy, I saw that, but they were sold out of what I wanted because I got everything I, I really wanted. They had that. Whoever got all the ribbon 
They left the good stuff behind is all I can say. Because what they took, it's just not, it's not me. But anyway, so, and then I just take it when I'm doing that, I just go in just a little bit. Um, I don't really measure stuff out. It's kind of like cooking. If you're, you know, if you're cooking, you don't just a pinch here and a pinch there. That's kind of how I do my bows. Just a pinch here and a pinch there. So. But like ours had them marked down for a hundred dollars the maker so that's cheap okay so there's my little small bow well it's not a little small bow but that's my smaller bow so we got the big bow and the small bonds let the small bow all right now i got some of these little shamrocks too i figured we could put these on there yeah check your walmart Sorry, Mark was calling. Okay, so um, check your Walmart and check the clearance. I, I saw it a couple weeks. Alright y'all, sorry. <laughs> it kept calling. It's always that like that. Somebody's gonna call or something when I go live. Oh well. Okay, sorry guys. Man. <laughs> he can call me anytime he wants that. That we can. I do not mind. Yeah, never fails. You are so right. Okay, so what I'm going to do is I have, what are these things called? I don't know. Whatever they're called. Bamboo sticks? Is that what they're called? Like, I'm at a loss. Anyway, I'm going to take, um, and I'm going to dip it in my glue. I'm going to get a good bit on there. Skewer. That's it. Thank you, Monica, because my brain's not functioning or something. I don't like I had any sleep. Okay. And I'm just coming in through the center here. And if you could think of a, um, <laughs> sorry, no, Roberta, he kept calling. But if you could think of a better way to do this, to make it sturdy, then go for it. This is just how I do it. Um, so now I'm going to kind of measure. Let's go down where y'all can see what I'm doing. Sorry. 
I'm not looking at me. Okay, so now I'm gonna kind of measure where I want this one to go. Cause I don't want it to be really too spaced out. And then I got that big old bow. So the big bow goes in here like this. So I don't want to cover it. I just kind of play with it. And you can always take it sideways, whatever you want to do with it. Now what I'm going to do, I'm going to come down here and I'm going to cut this at an angle. And I'll find that later, just so it's um, kind of sharp right there. And then we'll dip that in my glue. And then where I took the ribbon out at the top here, we're just going to put that in there like that. Work on a flat table though. Oh, shoot, that was not supposed to happen. So we're gonna have to piece that back together. Don't go too far in. You'll stab through it. I'm gonna stick this back on there. Oh, the taco soup is almost done. That you won't see it, thankfully, for the bow. And I think I'm going to do another one on here just so I feel better. Um, so, to make sure it's sturdy. You probably, I'm probably doing too much doing that, but it's okay. Yes, these come from Dollar Tree. Thanks, y'all, for helping for the ones coming in. Y'all are awesome. The um, shamrock did come from Dollar Tree. Aren't they cute? Let me pull that up. There. I'm not going to go too far in. I am going to add some more glue on this because I just pulled that out. I don't want to make sure it's in there good. Okay. So there's that. And then I'm going to go ahead and I'm going to cut some of these. These are the little shamrocks from Dollar Tree. Yeah, they do have a flat back side. I like them too. Three, four, and four. Five. And I also got the bright green. I got the dark green and the bright green so I can mix it up. Sorry, y'all. Being silent. Okay, come on. Quit being a pain. Gotta love the stickers. My goodness. Okay. And then I got this light green to add in there too. I don't know how I'm gonna do it yet. Because y'all know, you know me, I like to just kind of surprise myself sometimes. By the way, I didn't post that last live because, ow, I didn't like the, um, I just don't like the wreath. So I got to redo it. And sometimes you do that, you just make stuff and you're like, that was a total fail. But it was fun to be live with everybody again. I did get the cross. So I found the crosses at Dollar Tree. And I can't wait to do that. That'll be cute. Okay, so I can do... I don't know if I want to mix these up. Like this and have them come out like that. Or if I just want to add them into my bow. 
I'm thinking add them into my bow. I think that'll be pretty. Okay, so here, I'm just gonna take this bow. This is the bigger bow. Kind of wrapping on there on the back. I missed that. Sorry. I think it was Rachel. I'll have to read it when I go back and look later. So I'm wrapping my leftover um, green um, thing here around my. Bamboo sticks, whatever you want to call them. Just so you can't, it's not real noticeable. And it'll clean it up a little bit. I'll have to get another one. To finish it. But. And then it's okay, Karen. We did. I didn't say anything. I just decided to go off. I'm gonna. I'm gonna take these off the stems, and I'm just gonna add these into my leaves like that. I think that's pretty. Y'all, I'm seeing a lot of neat questions and I'm missing them. So just know I will go back and look, okay? Thank you, Kathy. I love making my bows. I think that's something that I took pride in was learning how to make rib bows. All right, I like that. That's neat. Hey, Anne Marie, it's good to be back. I, I'm glad to be back, y'all. I really am. I've missed everybody. Um, so Karen, we attached the shamrock using the bamboo sticks, shish kebab things, whatever you want to call them. And we just glued it and stuck them in there and attached them. I did two. And then it just attached them together. Easy peasy. And now we're just gluing in our um, our little shamrocks there. It's so cool. All right. And I have a whole bunch of glue sticks. That's okay. I'm going to keep my little loop here because that's what we want to hang it with. And then this one, this bow, this is the smaller bow. I'm just going to let it come in up here at the top and just wrap it around. Oh, I'm wrap it in here at the top. This is where I got to look at it. Now, I want you to be able to tell that it's a shamrock, so I'm going to kind of let this one go off to the side. And you know, black and white ribbon would be really, really cute with this as well. Um, and I had plenty of that, but I don't know. I just wanted something more. Elegant, I guess is what I'm looking for. Because to me, St. Patrick's Day isn't elegant. It is fun, and, and but I wanted something different. Hmm. 
I think I'll take this up to my office, unless it sells. And then I'll do something else with it. Make me something else to take it there. And there goes my daughter texting. It's always. I'm sure Colton will be next. got a long stem so I want this one to kind of go right here where you can see it better yeah you could always put a sign in the middle that would be really cute um Karen absolutely So, I mean, it could, this could probably be overbearing or whatever, but it's cute. See? And now it's just something simple to hang on the door. There. And it's just something that you can have, um, just a project that you can have. Uh, you know, a cheaper option in, in a store or your craft shows, whatever. My grandbabies are doing great. So, I think I've said it before. I don't know, but I have two grandbabies, boy and girl, Mandy Lynn and Garrett. And um, they are exactly one year apart. They share the same birthday. That is so cool to me. Laura was so upset because she didn't want to have um, she didn't want to have them on the same day. She wanted them to have their own special day, and I get that. But this is special too. You know, it's something that they'll um, they'll always have. They'll they'll always be able to talk about. They'll always share. So I thought it was kind of cool that they shared the same birthday exactly a year apart. Um, but anyway, so here's this. Cute, fun. You see, it didn't take us long. It didn't take long at all. And we've got a cute, um, fun little Dollar Tree project. 